Well, hello everybody, this is Sam Quill, and today we're gonna try out some Tooth and Tail. Uh... Yeah, we'll go with that. That's not what I meant. Anyway, I saw this as a free weekend this weekend, so I was like, oh, this is gonna be so cute, it's like Redwall. Because there was another game that I also saw that was looked like it was gonna be super cute called Moss, and I I can't afford to get that this month. But let's see. Select my region for online play. It is it's like Fifel goes west and Redwall all in one. I suppose I must be from here. We'll do story mode. Oh, I, should have done I told about my sand. son, we won't work the farms. No, we won't eat the food of beasts. We'll eat meat as any civilized animal does. But when the civilized called a harvest and the city feasted on my boy, we took to the warriors and lit the country aflame. Who decides the fate of animals? The long coats? The common folk? The KSR or the civilized. Whoever triumphs will go hungry no more. Those who fall will be dinner. Wow. That got dark fast. The civilized are fat from the feast. Now is our chance. Um, rally around the flag. I am the cursor. Long coats attack. Yes, warrior. Attack what? Oh. Brothers take some warns to bring in reinforcements. Okay. Oh, there's a stoat with a cannon on his back! Oh, that's so cute! Advance on those bullet hives. Okay, these things? Your tents! Fired. Forget! My job is to get behind our defenses. I don't I don't know where our defenses is. What are our defenses? What's that mean? Like this? Is this our defenses? If I rally while next to the enemy, my army will focus on it. Yeah, I figured that part out. You take four. So the little, those little weasels with their, with the. It's time to bring in the big guns. Advance to the civilized wrist. Keep it down. Oh, my. I think this is a terrible decision. Oh, 
Medic, kill the skunks. Is that a suicide bomb squirrel? Oh, oh, why? The grist mill is in sight. Destroy it. <laughs> the long coats will feast. Alright, so my first impressions. <laughs> Whenever I said this was going to be like Redwall, uh, I was not expecting this. Um, I read Redwall series fairly late in my adolescence, meaning I was in late middle school, early high school. Uh, and while those were very definitely children's books, they were not little children's books by any means. Uh, they covered some really dark topics, including cannibalism by animals, because some animals, like stoats and weasels uh, and honey badgers, oh, badgers in general, eat other animals. And one of the stories that bothered me the most, I can't say I like it, I can't say I didn't like it, was about Vale. Vale Sixclaw. And apparently is considered one of the most controversial characters. Outcast of Redwall. Vale's father was evil. I don't remember exactly what all he did, except that he killed uh, other creatures, and I'm pretty sure he ate them. And Vale had much of the same appetite, but he never indulged in it. Or if he did, he ate enemies of Redwall. Oh, I didn't read that. Sleep well, my child, something, something. Bone Pit riots were just the beginning, Bash. We have driven off Archimedes for now, but soon he'll return. And when he does, some of us will see the wrong end of his feasting table. A long coat's oath to freedom, to wealth, and a state of nature, a long coat's rise. Oh, uh, they took him last feasting day, a mere morsel of a boy. Hmm. Oh, such meaning. Hey, boss. We're doing just like you said, planning for the long haul. Turns out after your little stunt in the bone pits, Archimedes has reached out to his old comrades in the KSR. Now he's got greased mills churning out meat and black sledge. And the quartermaster's got her KSR goons keeping watch. Civilized. They're building up their larders, raising an army. But we have a surprise for them, yes? Just like you said, boss, we got tunnels running all the way out there. We'll take out those civilized grist mills and be back here in time for Cheskers. Okay, something else. Um, the voice actor. Who is that? Who is that brain? Stephen Briggs. The way he says civilized is exactly like Stephen Briggs in um, Carpe Jugulum. Carpe Jugulum? No. Not Carpe Jugulum. The fifth elephant. That's it. <sighs> Alright, let's see what this hint is. 
Select ferrets and use the rally group button to blast turrets from a distance. To counter falcon, select squirrels. How do I select anything? Tactics will be necessary here. I should start by building a wall. Scout for enemies. Can I can I build another one? There's there some falcons. Just now. <laughs> okay. 
I, I do not want to replay that mission. Modern animal eats his meat. The food of the beasts is for animals as well. Wait, what? Hmm. If my revolution is to succeed, I will need enough meat to feed the Criminals and swine may yet come in handy after all. I hear the civilized took your son, boss. What a waste. He could have been more than a morsel. Well, at least you all recognize him. Set him up and knock him down, Bella Fide. Engineer draws up pretty plans, even for dirty revolutionary like you. Bullet Hive is sturdy turret. Engineer get paid now? Uh, what do you say? Hey boss, we, uh, we have a bit of a problem. What kind of a problem? So, uh, some of my brothers were working on the mills down by the docks, you see. They mentioned seeing a yellow cloak or two, but I thought nothing of it. Now we're not getting any reports back from the docks. I think the civilized are making their move. Then so too must the longcoats. Prepare your bullet hives. We must defend the docks. Finish with 16 farms. Build farms around your grist mills to make food. Remember to build turrets before the enemy launches their attack. I'm not cool with this game. I mean, quite frankly, I'm I am a super hypocrite rat. How dare they eat my son? Here, let me eat all of these other creatures because they ate my son. However, I love that little fox down there. We should start by building the farms. Hmm. I'll travel with it. I suppose I burrow there. Okay. Archimedes will try to destroy me. I should build defenses. Dalosting yap samyachen. Bling yon wakar. How many am I allowed to build? That's no, a question. Begin, Lee. You ought to be a sepper. You can yet spawn gear, for yet your guinyat fim. No, I've seen a two teeth wash yet wall. Did you just say Dagu? Oh my god, I love you now. Oh, 
not you shall run yet. Okay. <laughs> the revolution has begun, and in, indeed. Well, this is certainly a very cute game, but I just don't think I can, I can get behind the the method to this madness. I understand these animals are, I mean, they're animals. My. I, I cannot get past the fact that my main reason for doing this is Oh, you ate my son Because I told him that we should eat meat And of course in order to eat meat we have to eat other animals And Then some other animals ate my son So now I'm going around eating all of them That, uh, that doesn't jive with me also, I, I don't think squirrels eat meat. I could be wrong. For rats and stoats and or weasels, even boars, that makes sense, because all of those are, are creatures that are omnivorous. Squirrels are not omnivorous. Omnivores, I mean. So, this is a cute game. It might be worth purchasing. I, I, I like the fact that it is, it, it is a tactical game. There is multiplayer mode where I assume you, you go up against other people and you try to destroy their farms and stuff. Um, so, I'll have a, a link to the Steam store page uh, down below. Uh, thank you for joining me. Uh, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. You can also hit me up on Twitter and Discord. Twitch at Simquill. Uh, let me know what you want to see me play. Uh, thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye!